I'm gonna walk you through exactly how to build a CI CD pipeline right from your GitHub repository. But first, let's talk through some benefits for GitHub Actions. With GitHub Actions, you don't need dedicated resources to maintain your pipeline. You can respond to any webhook on GitHub and its API directly from any repository. You could also leverage a GitHub Marketplace where there are 11,000 plus actions available for you to reuse in your workflows. Now to get started, you could start with a brand new repo or fork off another repo on GitHub. I'm actually leveraging a fork of my latest side project here. And the current branch that I have actually has no actions, which is not a bother because I can navigate to the actions tab on the top navigation bar here. You'll see quite a few workflows to get started. But here is a basic Node.js workflow, which is what I need. So I'm gonna go ahead and commit this directly to my branch. And I can already see the workflow has started running in the background. Now, if I go back to the workflow file that I just committed, you can see I'm running this on push and pull requests. So as I push this directly to the branch, it's already running. Now, I wanna mention that the main branch of this project already has a couple workflows that are running, and one of them is the CodeQL analysis workflow. The goal here is to discover vulnerabilities across a code base using semantic code analysis. Now, back to the workflow that I just added. I wanna make a quick change to the repo that I'm gonna do right now here. Uh, I have a footer component and I wanna add a new icon here. So let me go ahead and commit this and open up the PR. So clicking through, we can see these are the logs, the action logs, and we can get some insight to see what is happening, if there's any need for debugging or if there's failures. Now, each workflow can have the ability to run 20 async jobs in the free tier. Uh, I've added uh, quite a few extra separate jobs to run this build and also cut the release. If you're interested in taking a closer look at this workflow, this is open source, definitely check out the repo. And speaking of releases, we also have a GitHub action that comments on our PRs once they're merged and links directly to the release notes.